Hello everyone, my name is Cami, and welcome to my channel, Key to Disney, and welcome to day 22 of Vlogmas 2021. If you're new to my channel, welcome, and if you are returning, thank you so, so much for coming back. On my channel, we do mainly Disney content with a sprinkle of Bath and Body Works, but in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my puzzle collection. These are just the puzzles that I could find. I think I have some that aren't done like in boxes in the basement, but I didn't feel like going and fishing those out. But I'm going to be showing you my undone puzzles, the puzzles that I'm still waiting to do. Um, if you guys don't know already, I love doing puzzles. And if anyone doesn't know what to get me for a gift or anything, just buy me a puzzle. I love puzzles so, so much. I don't have like a huge puzzle collection because I do the puzzles and then I glue them together. I haven't figured out really how to store them, so I just kind of slide them behind one of my dressers. Um, but I'm not gonna go get those out because a lot of them aren't like glued all the way. So if I like were to pick them up, they would probably like crumble in my hands and I would be really sad. But I've got a pile next to me of puzzles. So let's get started with this one. I actually got this one from my boyfriend's mom and this is a um, collector's pins puzzle. And if you guys look at it, you can see like all the different pins. There's actually some pins on here that like I had growing up. And then on the back, here's a better picture if you guys can see this. And this is a 750 piece puzzle. And I think this is from, yep, from Seiko Puzzles. Um, there's a lot of good puzzle brands out there and Seiko is one of my favorite puzzle brands. So yes, this one has 750 pieces. And I just, I really love this one because you can stare at this for like 10 minutes and just looking at all the different pins that they chose to put on here and in this puzzle. And I think it is so, so fun. Like this one down here, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I do have this on a pin. So yeah, this puzzle is just really fun. I'm not really sure where she got it from, but I cannot wait to build this. The next puzzle I have is like more of, I think vintage, would you consider this vintage? I'm not really sure where it's from, when it's from, but it is a hundred piece um, puzzle of Walt Disney's favorites. Um, I haven't opened it and I'm never going to open it. I got it at a flea market. Um, my boyfriend bargained for it. Um, I don't remember. I remember when I posted this, They um, a couple people commented, where it was from like when it was from um but i think it's by the brand golden i did not pay 15 dollars for it i think my boyfriend like bargained the person down to five dollars um but yeah it's a hundred piece jigsaw puzzle and there's more in that series if you're if you're interested i guess these are the lists of the other ones in the series but it is 100 pieces and it's got alice bambi and cinderella on here which it is super, super cute. And I don't think I'm ever, ever, ever going to build that puzzle. The next one I have are Thomas Kincaid puzzles are like my favorite. They are so, so hard to do. Um, I do have another one of these Thomas Kincaid ones. It is a Mulan one. I'll throw it up on the screen. I can't find it. I don't know where it went, but I think I got that for my birthday or something. But I love this, these Thomas Kincaid puzzles. They usually come in four packs. Um, they also have like the single ones. I think I got this for like Christmas last year, maybe my birthday, can't really remember. But this one up here, we've got Fantasia Mickey. We've got Winnie the Pooh and Friends. And then down here we have Lady in the Tramp. And then over on this one, we have Rapunzel and Flynn. And again, these are 500 piece puzzles. And then this is also from like the puzzle brand Seiko. Um, and they come with posters inside, I believe. I don't know if they come with like all four of the posters, but it will come with at least one of them. I know that for sure. And like I said, they're 500 piece puzzles. And these are relatively cheap, like 12 to $15 for four or 500 piece puzzles is a really, really good deal. Moving on to another one of these packs that I have. Um, I It's hard because sometimes in these packs, I already have the puzzle that goes along with like, there'll be like one out of the four that I already have. So I'm like, I don't want to buy the whole new pack just for the one puzzle. But in this one, we've got Snow White, Mickey and Minnie like on vacation, um, which is so cute. Um, and then we've got Pocahontas and John Smith. And then we have another Mickey Mouse on vacation in France. Look at that, that's so fun. And again, 500 pieces, and there are four puzzles in these boxes. Moving on to my next puzzle pack, I have this Pixar one that has Soul, 
Finding Nemo, I'm assuming, and then Toy Story 2 for some reason. Such a weird combination, like since these are two older movies and then there's Soul. But I really got this solely for the Soul movie. Um, and then here it does come with a little puzzle glue, which is always nice. Um, I didn't realize that the Finding Nemo one is actually a circle. So I started doing it and I'm like, this is way too complicated. And then I put it away. But it's actually a circle, which I thought that was really interesting. I thought it was just going to be like, you know, just for packaging purposes but this is also from the brand Seiko and I really 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 like the Seiko puzzles I think they're super high quality moving on to a recent purchase of a puzzle I think is this by Seiko too yeah this is by Seiko I have more puzzles than not that are not Seiko branded but I honestly I can't find them so this is what we're going with today let's just say this is half of my puzzle collection but I got this super cute drive-in one I got this at Kohl's I had some Kohl's cash um I had $30 in Kohl's cash so I did get a couple puzzles but this is an a thousand piece of puzzle and it's got like Mickey and the gang and they're watching Snow White at the drive-in. This puzzle is so, so cute. It's got a thousand pieces. Uh, I think it was like 10 bucks at Kohl's, which isn't a bad deal because Kohl's can be kind of expensive. But here is the full image on the back. There we go without the glare. Um, look at the little hidden Mickeys in the sky of like the stars. That is so adorable. And like I said, it is a thousand pieces and it does come with a little poster of the um of the image that's on the puzzle, which I like that a lot. So yes, this is my second to last puzzle. And then last but not least, this one is so fun and I cannot wait to do this. But it's all like the Pixar like alien. It's an alien from Toy Story. There we go, dressed up as other Pixar characters. Look at how fun this is. This one's gonna be so fun and it's probably not gonna take me that long. And on the back, this one does have like the piece size of it. So it's gonna be a pretty, pretty big pieces. And it's only 300 pieces, so it's not gonna take me very long. I love the Marino one and I'm noticing that the design kind of like repeats, which is cute. But here it is. So that is all for Vlogmas Day 22. Short but sweet. I wanted to show you guys my puzzle collection because I know a few people who watch this also collect puzzles. But if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what puzzles do you have in your collection or do you even like puzzles? I know some people find them frustrating, but I think they're super, super relaxing. But if you like seeing my face, Disney or Bath and Body Works content, please consider subscribing to my channel. It's free to you and it helps me out so much and you guys can always change your mind later. Thanks again, you guys, for watching Vlogmas Day 22 and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bells swing and jingle bells ring.